Hello friend, I'm Prachakta Bhur from Paragate Technology. In our previous video, we learned how to create or how to establish integration between Salesforce and Dynamic X. This video will let you know how to create report and dashboard in Salesforce. So let's start. Go to the All tabs and select Reports and click on New Report. So I want to create a report on my account object. So let's say create. Yeah, and this is the platform where you create a report. Now account owner, account name, type, rating, these all are the account fields. If you want to add another fields, then you can just click, drag and drop the fields. I don't want billing state, so I will drag and drop here. So from here, you can add the filter on like uh, where clause of query the show is the view I'll select all account and I don't want to sort my record by date so I'll cancel it and here you can see these all are the account records of my organization so we will see the type of reports tabular summary matrix and join these all are the type of reports tabular report it shows the record in table format you cannot use tabular report to create the dashboard if you want to create a dashboard then your report must be of summary type or the matrix type summary report it allows grouping of rows of a data and also it supports the sorting and uh, displaying subtotals matrix report it a little bit complex type of report and this report summarize the information in a grid format matrix reports allows the records to be grouped by both column and row but in case of summary Summary report, it just group the record by the row wise. Now the joint report. It lets you view the different types of information in a single report. That means it can contain the data from multi multiple standard or the custom report type. Okay. Now I want to create the summary report. So I will click on summary and I want to group my record by using the rating. So I'll just click and drop it here yeah here you can see it just grouped by the rating the rating hot I have two records rating warm I have three records and rating cold I have two records so this is what my report I'll run my report by clicking on run report so here you can see all the records are shown so let's save by say as save and here you can give the yeah demo report demo report say for account okay and let's say save so my first report is get ready now we will learn how to create a dashboard so let's click on new dashboard so salesforce provide this much of um, chart to create a dashboard we have bar chart line chart pie chart funnel chart okay so let's take a funnel chart and to create a dashboard we have to give the input of report so click on data source go to the reports and this is what the folder where I have saved my report and I will just drag and drop my report so meanwhile we will change the name so I want the demo dashboard for let's say account okay and this is what so um, we will say save I will give the name demo dashboard and let's say save okay I think this is already exist so we will say for account and say save Yeah, and here you can see our dashboard is get created. So let's say save and here you can see my cold record is two. That means I have two accounts that are cold by rating, hot two and these 11 are the remaining. So 
always remember to create a dashboard we must have summary type of report and the matrix type of report okay thank you for watching this video guys to know about us you can visit paraguide.com thank you bye bye